China recently unveiled the Jiu Tian, a massive new drone they claim will reshape the future battlefield. Beijing is marketing this as a rule changer. But let's look past the propaganda and see what the CCP is actually putting on the runway. On paper, the specs are aggressive. It boasts a 25-meter wingspan and a 16-ton takeoff weight. They are specifically targeting U.S. capabilities, claiming a 6-ton payload that allegedly dwarfs the battle-tested NQ-9 Reaper's 1.4-ton limit. They also claim a 15,000-meter service ceiling to evade standard air defense, with a stated range of 7,000 kilometers and 12-hour endurance at 700 kph. The goal is obvious: global power projection without the network of forward bases the U.S. maintains. The real concern, if the tech actually works, is the Hive mission bay. They claim it can dump 200 to 300 micro drones in 10 seconds, swarming a 15 square kilometer area. Their simulation data claims this swarm drops air defense interception rates from 98% down to 30%. It features heavy hardpoints for YJ-12 anti-ship missiles and even hypersonic weapons. They market it as a modular bomber and electronic warfare jammer that can swap mission sets in two hours, classic dual-use strategy. Throwing around buzzwords like AI coordination and quantum communication, Beijing claims this platform can command other drones like the FH-97 to form a strike web. They assert this cheap, modular system can paralyze a U.S. carrier strike group for a third of the cost of traditional forces. Whether these specs hold up in real combat remains to be seen, but the intent is clear. China is rushing to overtake U.S. dominance in unmanned warfare using mass and saturation.